uh, the idea of like uh, the state. Uh, so some people say the state is good. Let the state control your lives because the state is voted on by us. The state represents us, our interests. So let the state have more control. It will create um, less crime. It will monitor everywhere, put cameras everywhere. You know, uh, a woman was killed recently. There was an uproar um, about that in London. And, you know, the call is more state security, more increased state security. State will protect us. And then you have other people say, wait, 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 but, but in our history, the state has gone crazy. And if it gets con taken over by a cabal or, a, or some kind of um, uh, people who have a, um, uh, who have a conspired agenda amongst themselves, they can take control of the government. And then we, will, we won't be able to get our freedom back once they take it from us. And they ban elections. And then how are you going to get your, your freedom back without being, being able to fight against it? And of course, in America, uh, um, as you know, um, they have, uh, you know, a certain amendment which they keep on. They, they really will jealously guard, which is the right. The amendment that allows them the right to bear arms. Why? Because they follow an older interpretation of liberalism, which says you can't trust the state. So you have to have weapons so that if the state goes, if the state goes um, off the off the manhaj, <laughs> off the uh, off the dean of liberalism, uh, then you have to be jihadi, right, and fight against the state. Yeah. So it's jihadi. It's liberal jihadism, if you want to call it. The jihadi. <laughs> Um, yeah, of yeah. course, of course. Yeah. but that, that's why, that's what the Founding Fathers said, yeah. right? 